Hi there, welcome to Hughes Nursery and here's another video in the Pests and Disease series and we have, um, like most years, a bit of a problem with aphids so I'm going to show you a really easy way um, just to make a spray uh, in, in de insecticide or something um, that you spray onto your plants and uh, it like kills off the aphids which is good now there are many ways of um, getting rid of aphids and I will show you another way just using tomato leaves but I'll hopefully do that a bit later on so you just want about 500 milliliters of water which is um, 500 milliliters of water which is half a litre um, just under a pint. Uh, I don't know how many quarts it is, but I'll tell you down below. Now, you want per 500 milliliters of water, you want to add about a tablespoon of soap. Now, the soap you use is got to be important. Um, I use Ecova, which is an organic soap, and it doesn't have any chemicals in. Now, if you use like a detergent that has chemicals in, and you don't want that to be added into your organic garden, so just mix that in like that. And then the reason why you put in the soap after, not before, is because you get loads and loads of bubbles. So now, just simply fill this up. Yeah, there's the bubbles. So, now let's apply this to the plants. So luckily we haven't had too many aphids today, um, or this growing season at all, but this is a tomato plant and aphids love it. Now aphids, they're about um, one tenth of an inch long, uh, fully grown, and ants like to milk them for the sort of milk that they make and uh, use them as a food. So, and aphids like to eat the pollen, well sap. So when you're just going to spray your plant, if you have a pump spray it's going to be much easier but you want to just go around like this, spraying all the top of the leaves and don't forget the stem because remember the stem is the main motorway for these pests. So after you've done that you then want to go underneath and spray all the underneath of the plants like that and uh, that makes sure that you get both ends of the plant so aphids are not going to get away um, with, with um, uh, eating your plants that quickly um, another thing you can do is to get a really strong hose of water and spray it on now I do have quite a big problem with that because um, it, it a waste water and um, I just think that if you use lots of water, waste enough to spray aphids, it's a waste of time. Now, if you do use that, um, it will make all the aphids fall to the floor. And uh, what I would do is uh, paint on a bit of honey uh, at the stem to uh, stop aphids climbing back up. And yeah, so that's the really simple and easy way of how to make uh, spray for aphids and other things don't like it like black fly and white fly for example so I hope you enjoyed that quick video and I'll see you again very soon with another one